And today we're at Posh and Petite Playhouse in Woodland Hills, California. <laughs> Did you know this is a place where we can explore and be curious about different jobs? <laughs> I can't wait to try different jobs like an ice cream maker or a firefighter. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Which way should we go? Oh, check out this road. <laughs> Look. It's black with white stripes. Oh, black and white are opposite colors. Opposites mean they're completely different from one another. Kind of like, oh, night and day or hot and cold. <laughs> oh, check it out. Do you see that horse over there? Oh, let's drive our car over to him. Hello, horsey! <laughs> I'm gonna name him Popsicle, cause I really love Popsicle. <laughs> Can you pretend to be a horse? <gasps> Play! Whoa! Oh, he's got a lot of horsepower. Let's go! <laughs> Check it out, it's a marketplace. We can buy healthy fruits and vegetables here and make delicious meals. I know, let's be a grocer. <laughs> All right, see you later, Popsicle. First, we need our basket. <laughs> oh, wow, check it out. If we wanna be a grocer, we have to get some items to put in our basket so we can ring it up. First, we'll need some alphabet soup. That's healthy and delicious. And how about some peas and carrots? And, ooh, mushrooms too. Check out all these healthy fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables are good for your body because they help you grow strong. <laughs> I got it. Let's play a game. Fruit or vegetable? A carrot. It's orange and crunchy, and bunny rabbits love to eat them. Mmm, tasty. <laughs> Do you know if this is a fruit or a vegetable? Oh, that's right, a vegetable. Great job. All right, how about this? It's a cucumber. It's green and it has seeds. Fruits have seeds and vegetables don't. Fruit or vegetable? Oh yeah, that's a tricky one. It's a fruit, even though it seems like it's a vegetable. But great job. Hmm. Oh, yum. A strawberry. Strawberries are really, really sweet. Is a strawberry a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> awesome. A fruit. One fruit point, please. Hmm. Oh, look. A lemon. Lemons are one of my favorite colors. Yellow, and they're really sour. Can you pretend to taste a sour lemon? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, sour is the opposite of sweet. Strawberries are sweet, but lemons are sour. Is this a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a fruit, just like the sweet strawberry. Okay. Ooh, check it out, a piece of corn. Mmm, <gasps> that's delicious. Do you know if it's a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a yummy vegetable. All right, let's go check out now. Welcome to Mika's Marketplace. Oh, I see you got corn. And you're in luck, because we have a special on corn. Just one cent. And a lemon. And our sweet strawberry. And a delicious carrot. And alphabet soup. Peas and carrots. Mmm, mushrooms. Wow, you got so many healthy options. <laughs> 
Peter Grocer is so much fun. We even got to help a customer take home delicious vegetables to make yummy meals. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Yeehaw! We're at an ice cream shop. I know, let's pretend to be ice cream makers. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Let's go! Welcome to Mika's Magical Ice Cream Parlor. What's that? Fresh baked cookies? <laughs> Coming right up. Look at that, fresh out the oven. Oh, they smell delicious. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve crispy cookies. Let's taste one. Mmm, that's delicious. Would you like a bite? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Mmm. Do you know what this is? That's right, a purple popsicle, just like my horse's name. <laughs> Would you like a popsicle? There you are, one for you and one for me. Oh, that's really cold. Perfect for a hot day. Oh, those are opposites, hot and cold. When I'm cold, oh, it makes me shiver. But when I'm hot, oh, I could sure use a popsicle. <laughs> Would you like some ice cream today? Great. How many scoops? Oh, five scoops? Okay, here we go. One chocolate scoop. Two, a vanilla scoop. Three, mint chocolate chip. There you go, friend. Perfect. Four, a strawberry scoop. And five, a vanilla scoop on top. Oh, wow, it's stacked up so high. Mm. <laughs> I love being an ice cream maker. I love scooping ice cream and tasting it too. Hey, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> Okay, let's see what other jobs we can do. <gasps> oh, don't forget Popsicle. Hello, Popsicle. Are you ready? Are you set? Go! <gasps> wow, check it out. We're in front of a fire station. A firefighter's job is to put out fires. Do you want to be a firefighter with me? <laughs> Awesome, let's go. This is a cool fire station. Oh, look, a fire truck. It's red and really long too. <laughs> and look at these trucks. Let's go park. All right, to the parking lot we go. <laughs> oh, and look at these trucks. They're really big. Oh, and these trucks are small. Big and small, those are opposites. How about this one? Big or small compared to this truck? Pretty small, right? <laughs> but what about compared to this one? Oh, now it's really big. <laughs> Do you hear that? It's a siren. Oh, we gotta get ready to go. Put out a fire. Hello? Yes? Fire? On one, two, three, fire road? Oh no! Let's go! Grab our hose! <gasps> Firefighter Mika is on the way. Grab my hose and save the day. Oh, awesome. We just put out a fire. Oh, that 
was so much fun. Thanks for helping me. You're very brave. Firefighters are really brave. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Whoa, look, an animal hospital. This is where veterinarians work. Veterinarians are doctors, but for animals. Would you like to be a veterinarian with me? <laughs> awesome, let's go. Oh, look at these doors. A small door for turtles and hamsters and gerbils too, and a medium door for bunny rabbits and ducks, quack, quack, and ferrets and guinea pigs too. And a large door for cats and dogs. Large and small, those are opposites. <laughs> cool. Oh, and look at this door for birdies. Oh, that's another opposite, high and low, low and high. <laughs> Let's pretend to be birds fly into the vet's office. Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> oh, do you hear that? Paging Dr. Mika, you have a patient ready. Okay. Oh, and check it out, here's our patient. Hello, puppy, how are you today? Little scratches, scratches. Did your family bring you here for a checkup? Oh, awesome. All right, let's get started, boy. We have a stethoscope. Stethoscopes are for hearing what's inside of your body, like your heart. Oh, may I check your heart too? Great. Wow, that sounds nice and strong. Okay, let's check puppy's heart. This might be a little cold. Wow, that sounds so healthy and strong. You must be getting on your daily walks, huh? Don't forget to hydrate, okay? Doctor's orders. <laughs> Oh, being a veterinarian is so much fun. I love helping animals and their families too. <laughs> now that I checked out the whole town, I'm gonna hit the road. Are you ready, Popsicle? <laughs> Let's go, giddy up! <laughs> Thank you so much for exploring different jobs with me today. <laughs> if I had to choose, I'd be a ice cream maker, grocer, animal doctor, firefighter. <laughs> all at once. <laughs> they were all so much fun, I can't just pick one. <laughs> but you know the best part? Exploring with you, friend. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? Oh, great! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today, I'm at the Paint Place in New York City. Here at the Paint Place, they have a ton of different art supplies. You can make a sculpture or a painting, but I really want to make a mixed media piece. That's where you use a lot of different materials to make one art piece. Let's go. Oh, paint place. <gasps> Come on. Wow, there are so many cool paintings in here. I see an artist. Come on. Hey. I'm Mika, what's your name? I'm Mika, I'm Deirdre. Oh, hi Deirdre, nice to meet you. What do you do here? I'm an instructor at the paint place, I'm an artist. Oh, oh, you're a very good artist. What is this? This is the New York City skyline. <gasps> New York City, that's where we are right now. I think I want to make a skyline too, but I want to do a mixed media piece. Oh, absolutely, you're going to need more supplies though. So okay. why don't you grab it from the table? Oh, all right, thanks, see you soon. Whoa, look at all of these materials that I get to use for my mixed media piece. Oh, oh, here's an apron. That's super important because that way I can protect my clothes from paint or glue. Let me just tie this on. 
<laughs> Look at all the paint that's already on the apron. <laughs> okay, let's see. What do I want to use? Oh, check this out. Do you know what shape this is? It's a circle. And there's a lot of little circles around it. You want to count the circles with me? Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten little circles. This is a paint palette. You can put different colors of paint in the little circles. Oh, I definitely need that. Hmm, what else? Oh, some paint brushes for sure. I like these little ones for detailing. Throw those in there. Oh, there's different kinds of ways to apply paint to a canvas. You could use a paintbrush or a sponge. That can make a really fun texture. I'm gonna throw that in there. Hmm. Oh, glue. I might need some glue. Let's see. Look at all of these colors. I see some of my favorite colors in here. I'm gonna use, ooh. Purple, oh yeah. Purple in there and hmm. Yellow. <laughs> wow, it would be so cool to have purple and yellow buildings. And this blue is pretty cool too. So purple, yellow, blue, hmm. Looks like some of these papers are already cut out. Might need some of these. I'll get red and blue and yellow. Throw in some extra. Okay. Whoa, there's felt pieces cut out. Oh, what do we have here? <laughs> Look, there's a person. Hey, do you want to be in my skyline painting? Yes, I do. Oh. Great! You can go in there and what kind of shapes are over here? <gasps> a sunshine! My skyline could be during a sunny day. Oh, you're definitely going in there. And some squiggles, those are fun. Throw those in there and just throw them all. Wow, look at all these different colored puffy balls. Woo! They're called pom poms. Hmm. I think I'm gonna throw some in there. And, oh, I'll definitely need scissors. If you're gonna use scissors, make sure you're with a grown up. And, ooh, a sponge roller. That can be fun. Another way to apply paint. And, whoa, look at all of these different colors. I'm gonna throw that in there. And whoa, look at this cool paintbrush. <laughs> the big paintbrush. This one is kind of like a triangle. Ooh, that'll be fun. And some colored pencils. Oh, this is gonna be so colorful. What a great way to remember my day in New York City. I'm missing anything? <gasps> I need a canvas. This will do it. All right, let's get started. I'm so excited to make this art piece. Oh, here's an easel. Put my canvas right there. And I'll put my materials over here. Hey, there's other paint here. Look at this bright pink. Ooh, kind of matches my nails. This is acrylic paint, which is different than the watercolor paint that I put in my basket over there. Acrylic paint is thicker than watercolor paint. Watercolor is thinner and transparent, which means you can see through it. Hmm. I think I'm actually gonna use the acrylic paint today. All right. Uh, oh, I'll use my paint palette. So I'm gonna make a sky and water. So I'll need blue. Oh, here's some blue paint right here. Okay. Whoop, see? Nice blue paint. And, oh, look at this blue. I love this color. It's kind of like a turquoise or a teal. Put that on there. <gasps> so pretty. And I'll add some black. Ooh. <laughs> and white. There we 
go. Check it out. And I'll need a paintbrush. Oh, this looks like a perfect paintbrush for my sky and my water. All right, let's get started. <laughs> okay, starting with a blank canvas. I can go anywhere. I'm feeling inspired. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna start with the sky. So I think I'm gonna use this blue and a little bit of white. Get some water on there. And I have to be careful because acrylic paint could stain my clothes. Good thing I'm wearing an apron. <laughs> Uh, get this beautiful blue sky. Okay, I think the sky's looking pretty good. And now I'm gonna do the water, the river. Hmm. Maybe make the water a little darker than the sky. Some more blue. And if I add black to it, I can make it a little darker than the sky. Okay, now I see a hair dryer. That's such a smart way to make the paint dry faster. Hey. See? Whoop. I'm gonna dry my paint so then I can add the next material. Oh yeah. Okay, I think that's pretty good. Hmm, my water looks really dark. Oh, I bet if I added some blue to it, it would make it look a little more like water. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, whoops. Okay, I'm gonna add more blue. Let's see. This will brighten it up. Because it's so dark, it looks like a street almost, but I really want it to be water. And I'm gonna add a little white. It's always important to clean your brush in between colors. Get some white on there. Wow, so I have sky and water, and I want some clouds up here. <gasps> I can use my fingers to make clouds. Okay. It's so cool how you can use different things to apply paint. <laughs> and the good thing about a paint apron is you can just ride off. Three puffy clouds. Whoop. All right, let me get. Now let's dry the clouds. Okay, check it out. It's the Empire State Building. I'm gonna have that building in my New York City skyline. <laughs> okay, let's put some buildings on my canvas. Let's get a lot of glue on here so my buildings stick. Here. Look, a yellow rectangle. Rectangles make really good buildings. All right, I finished gluing on my buildings. Now I'm gonna move on to my felt pieces. <gasps> Remember this, friend? Put some glue. All right. What should I name this person? Hmm. I think I'm gonna name him George! <gasps> George, where do you wanna go? Oh, okay. All right, you're a little close to the water, George, but I get it. It's the summer, you wanna cool off. And, oh, my sunshine! 
to find my felt. <gasps> Sunshine, there it is. Okay, I'll put the sun here. Oh, I love it. I think it would be really cool to add some cotton balls to my clouds. There's some over here. Oh, don't these look like clouds? Soft and fluffy and white. All right, let's see what it will look like. Add some here. Yeah, cool, I like it. What do you think? I think the clouds look really cool. And now, I think I'll add some details to the buildings. I'll need a small paintbrush, like this one. Isn't this so fun? It's what's cool about mixed media. You can use all different kinds of materials to make an art piece. Oh, I still have some white paint here. Water in there, and then Let's see, maybe this building can have some windows. Might be an apartment building. Oh, George lives here. George, you have a great building. Nice tenants. Okay. And then maybe some lines here, lines there. This building can have lines like that. And I'm gonna do three lines on this one. One, two, three. What's so cool about art is you can do whatever you want. All right. So details, I think that's pretty good. And I forgot I have something in my jam pack. Glitter! <laughs> I'm gonna put some glitter on my painting. What do you think? Yeah. All right, I need some glue so the glitter sticks. I think it would look good in the water. Sparkly water. Now my mixed media art piece is all complete. Oh, hey Deidre. Hi, this looks amazing. Thank you, I had so much fun making it. I know the perfect spot where we can hang it up. Really? Yes, yeah, someone's coming to pick up their painting, so why don't we hang up yours? <gasps> I get to be on the wall with the other artist? That's so cool. I hope you enjoyed the paint place. I did, it was so fun. Thanks for having me. Bye. All right, see you later. Well, I feel like a real artist now. <laughs> that was so fun. Well, guess I don't need my apron anymore because I'm all finished with my art piece. What a great day at the paint place. I got to make a mixed media art piece using construction paper and felt pieces and paint and glitter. Oh, that was so cool. And I even got to hang it up on the wall <laughs> like an official artist. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E. K-A-H, Mika. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm visiting Half Peak in Southgate, California. Did you know this is a place where we can rock climb? <laughs> yeah, rock climbing is a fun way to exercise our bodies. Oh, I have an idea. Let's play a game. Every time I make it all the way to the tippy top, I'm gonna get a Mika point. <laughs> Doesn't that sound fun? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Wow, check out all these climbing towers. <gasps> oh, before we start climbing, we should stretch and warm up our bodies. Stretching is a great way to keep your muscles healthy and safe. Okay, starting with those legs. Ah, deep breaths. Ah. Oh. Do you hear that? I 
just got a Mika point for stretching. Ah, uh, yeah! Oh, before I climb, I should take off my jam pack. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, wow! Hey, I'm Mika, nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Bertha, nice to meet you. <laughs> did you just climb all the way to the top? Yes, I did. Oh, wow! Can you show me how to get ready to climb? Yeah, of course. Awesome! <laughs> What's the first step? Thank you. Okay, so the first step, I have to get a harness on you, just for your own safety, okay? Oh, great. We're gonna get a harness on so we can be safe while we climb. Okay, so once you're ready, you're gonna put your right foot and left foot in the small holes and then just pick it up like their pants, okay? Oh, great. Right foot, left foot. Pick them up like their pants. Good job. And you're gonna hold it on your waist. Thank you. Get in it. Okay, you can let go. Great, I feel really secure. All right, you're good. Okay, and now the next step, you're gonna get your wheel and you're gonna put it in here, okay? Got my wheel. Hear the click and then you get your key and then take it right out. Release the key. There you go. <gasps> Great. And then just let your mat come down and then you're good to go. Thank you so much, Bertha. Yeah, of course. Bye. <laughs> okay, my harness is on and I'm locked into the belay and I'm ready to go because I'm safe and ready. <laughs> Are you ready? Come on, let's climb. using the muscles in my legs and my arms. <laughs> Great job. Wow, another Mika point. It was so cool. I can't wait to climb another wall. But first, we have to get out of our wheel. Pick up the key. Wait for the click. There it is. And release our wheel. Woo. <laughs> Great. Are you ready for our next wall? Me too. Let's go. We're at our next wall. But first, let's stretch again. All right. Here's how I stretch my legs. Yeah. And here's how I stretch my arms. Whoa. <laughs> stretch out my toesies too. And don't forget those ears. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> All right, I'm ready. Take my wheel, click, and release the key. I'm ready to go. <laughs> Whoa, don't these look like eggs? <laughs> All right, here I go. Wow, another Mika point. Whoa, I made it all the way to the top by taking it one step at a time. <sighs> all that climbing has made me kind of tired. I think now's a great time for a water break. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, let's put in our key. Click. Grab our wheel. <sighs> let's go. I'm having so much fun climbing walls with you, but I'm feeling a little thirsty. Good thing I brought my water bottle. More Mika points, yeah! Whoa, did I just get another Mika point for drinking water? <laughs> Great! <sighs> climbing up high is a lot of fun, but it's important to drink water after you play. That's called staying hydrated, and it's really good for your body. Okay, now that I'm hydrated, I'm ready to climb the coolest wall ever. Are you ready? Great, let's go. Check 
Check it out. We made it to our next wall. Oh, and it's icy and so chilly. It's Mount Everest and it's really, really cold. Warm up your hands with me. Oh, I know. Let's dance it out to warm up our bodies. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, I'm ready. Let's buckle in and head up the mountain. Click, Mika Point. Here I come. It was cold, but I had a lot of fun. I saw so many polar bears at the top. And I earned a Mika point. And we got a Mika point. You know what else I earned? <gasps> Some hot cocoa. Ooh, nice and warm. Mmm. Now let's go see what other fun things we can do. Surprise! Here I am. <laughs> oh, check out these blocks. I want to stack them. Yellow and then blue. Oh, let's do another yellow and another blue. Whoa, cool pattern. A pattern is something that repeats itself. See? Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Let's put another yellow one on top. Whoa, it's getting so high. Another blue at the very top. Ooh. Whoa, I got it, cool. <laughs> Let's see if we can put another yellow one on top. Okay, here I go. Whoa! Awesome! That was so much fun. Let's find another wall to climb. Whoa! This wall is awesome. It looks like seven bouncy balls stacked on top of each other. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is going to be the most challenging climb yet. Challenging means it's going to take a little bit more effort than before, but I'm up for the challenge. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get a Mika point for every ball I climb on. That's going to be a lot of Mika points. You ready? <laughs> Me too. All right, put our wheel in. Click. And release the key. Make a point. Here I come. Put in my key, release the wheel. <gasps> that was so much fun. It was challenging, but we made it all the way to the top. Great job! <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> wow, today was awesome. First, we stretched our bodies and warmed up. Then Bertha showed us how to put on a harness so we could safely climb our first wall. <gasps> we had hot cocoa on top of Mount Everest. Then we finished with a grand finale on the seven bouncy balls and earned lots of Mika points. You helped me earn this many Mika points today. <laughs> Whoa, we make such a great team. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? Great! 
M E E K A H. Mika. Okay, see you later. Bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. Today I'm at a really cool place called Sequest Interactive Aquarium in Las Vegas, Nevada. That's right. Interactive means we get to pet, feed, and say hi to some of the animals we meet. I'm so excited to meet some adorable animals. Let's go. Whoa, check out this canoe. It has so many bright colors. Let's name the colors. Red, black, yellow, one of my favorite colors. Orange and brown too. I know, let's get inside and go find some animal friends. Whoa, the waters are really rough. Grab your oar. Great job, keep going. Whoa, I can see the shore is getting closer. Let me make sure we're going the right way. Oh yeah, we're traveling west. <laughs> keep rowing, friend. You're doing a great job. Oh, we made it to shore. Let's go see what animal friends we can find. Wow! Look at these sea stars. They're so bright and colorful. Let's take a closer look. Let's count how many arms this one has. One, two, three, four, five. Five arms. <laughs> Did you know when sea stars injure their arms, they just grow back. <laughs> and sea stars have a very interesting way of eating. They wrap their arms around their food, spit out their bellies. The bellies eat up all the food. Yum, 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 yum. And then they go back into their body. Whoa. <laughs> Check it out. That's called a sea urchin. It's round and kind of prickly. And that's a sea anemone. Let's give it a pet. Whoa, it's so soft. <laughs> Let's pet this sea star too. Oh, that was much harder. Okay, see you later. <laughs> oh, a stingray. <laughs> Ooh. Whoa, there are real stingrays over there. Let's go say hello. <laughs> wow. <gasps> stingrays have flat bodies so that they can get nice and snug in some sand in case they need to protect themselves. <laughs> and they love to eat shrimp. <gasps> hey, I know. Let's feed them some of my sea quest shrimp that I have in my jam pack. <laughs> Okay, friends, it's lunchtime. <laughs> Here you go. Yeah! Oh! <laughs> Let's see if we can get some more stingray friends to eat some lunch. There you go. How about a pet? Oh, here's a friend. <laughs> you must be really hungry, friend. Oh, whoa. Did you see that shark? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> Let's feed them some more. <laughs> Stingrays move very wavy like this. That's because they don't have any bones. It was so nice to meet you, Stingrays. Let's go see what other friends we can find. <laughs> Whoa. I heard this tortoise's name is Stormin' Norman. <laughs> Hi, Norman. I'm Mika. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> Tortoises have hard shells that protect their bodies. Their arms, legs, and head can go inside of it. <laughs> Whoa. And did you know tortoises do something called broom mating? That's when they sleep longer in the winter months. <laughs> 
Let's see if Stormin wants some food. I have some Sequest jicama in my jam bag. <laughs> Here you go, Norman. No, doesn't seem like he's hungry. That's okay. I'll hold on to your food for later. <laughs> well, bye, Norman. Let's go see some other animal friends. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Janelle. Hey, Janelle. What do you do here? I'm the lead keeper here. Wow, that's so cool. Oh, are you about to feed the animals? Yes, would you like to go in? I'd love to. Great, let's go. Let's go. This is Azalea. <laughs> Hi, Azalea. What does Azalea like to eat? She likes to eat different kinds of greens and haze. She's got flat teeth so she can chew on those. Oh, wow, they're herbivores. That means they like to eat plants. <laughs> May I feed her? Yes, you can. Here you go, Azalea. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> perfect. Did you know wallabies can balance on their tails? <laughs> wow. And how are wallabies different from kangaroos? It's mostly size. Kangaroos get about six feet, where these guys get to about three and a half, four feet in height. Oh, so wallabies are much smaller. <gasps> can I pet Azalea? Yes, we're gonna do a two finger touch down her back. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so soft. Can you tell me any other facts about wallabies? Yes, they're marsupials. Oh, I know what that means. Marsupials carry their babies in pouches. <laughs> kind of like a jam pack. Oh, do you hear that hopping sound? <laughs> hop, hop. Let's hop like a wallaby. Hop, hop. <laughs> Would you like to go see some other animals? Yes, I'd love to. Great, let's go. Let's hop away. Hop, hop. Whoa, prairie dogs. I know, prairie dogs like to live in groups. That's right, they also like to communicate with each other through chirps and noises. Whoa, will you chirp like a prairie dog with me? Chirp, 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 chirp. And prairie dogs like to burrow. That means they live underground and they like to nuzzle each other's noses. <laughs> and they groom each other too. That's how they stay clean. That's right, would you like to feed them? <gasps> yes, please. Yep. Oh, look, they like lettuce. Oh, are you ready to eat, friend? There you go. <laughs> what does it mean when they do this? They like to play with you, would you like to try? Sure, let's see if they'll Play with me. Hello, friend. Will you dance with me? Can we see some other animals? Yes, let's go. Great. Who's this? This is Percy the Possum. Oh, Percy is so fluffy. He's a marsupial. Do you remember the other marsupials we met? <laughs> yeah, the wallabies. Wow, Percy has such a strong tail. Is that for climbing trees? Yes, this is a prehensile tail. Mm, prehensile means there are lots of muscles in his tail. <laughs> what does Percy like to eat? Percy likes to eat lots and lots of bugs at nighttime. Mm. And he likes to eat little snacks here and there. Ooh. Would you like to feed him one? Yes, please. Oh, yum, sweet potato. Here you go, Percy. Yum, he's got a big mouthful. Can I pet him? Yes, you can. <laughs> How does Percy differ from other marsupials? He's nocturnal. Oh, nocturnal means that he sleeps during the day and is awake all night. How many teeth does Percy have? He has the most amount of teeth of a North American uh, marsupial or oh. mammal. <laughs> Oh, great, it was so nice to meet you, Percy. <gasps> Who's this? This is Quilliam. <laughs> Hi, Quilliam. Is he named Quilliam because of these quills? Yes. <laughs> these quills help keep Quilliam safe. Whenever he's frightened, he just fans out his quills and that means please stay back. 
finds an African crested porcupine. <gasps> an African crested porcupine is the biggest porcupine in the world. Can I feed him? Yes, you can. Ooh, what's this? There's yucca. He likes to eat root vegetables. Sweet potato, yucca. <laughs> Quilliam, would you like some yucca? Here you go, Quilliam. Very tasty, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Feels like William has very strong teeth. He does. He has rodent teeth. They never stop growing. He's also got a special enamel on him that keeps him from getting <laughs> cavities. Oh, that's really helpful. <laughs> Thank you so much for showing me all these animals. You're welcome. <laughs> Bye, Janelle. Bye, William. Bye, Mika. Whoa! A coloring station. Would you like to color with me? <laughs> Great! <laughs> I'll start with purple. <gasps> I know. Can you guess what animal I'm coloring that we saw earlier today? I'll give you a few hints. This animal has eyes on top of its head and a mouth on the bottom of its body. Ooh, I want to use black next. <laughs> this animal loves to eat shrimp. <laughs> Ooh, I'm coloring with blue now. This animal has a really long tail. Do you know what it is? That's right, a stingray. <laughs> I think I'll name my stingray Shirley. <laughs> Come on, Shirley, let's swim away. <laughs> Look, Stingray, I can move like you. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun meeting all those Stingrays and Azalea the Wallaby and Quilliam the Porcupine. Wow, those animals were so cute. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> Okay, let's hop away like wallabies. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at O2B Kids in Orlando, Florida. This place is really fun. They have games, they have dance classes, and I want to learn some new dance moves. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, Mika, I'm Trudy. Welcome to O2B Kids, the new learning playground. Oh, thank you so much. So I want to learn some new dance moves today. Mr. Christian is available for a dance lesson right now. Really? Where is it? You can head to the theater. Oh, let's go to the theater. <gasps> this is it, the theater. Oh, let's go inside. Whoa! <laughs> Amazing dance moves! Thank you. Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, I'm Mr. Christian. I'm the dance teacher here. <gasps> Wow, a dance teacher? Could you give me a dance lesson? Sure, but first, what moves do you want to learn? Oh, I want to learn a hip hop move, a break dance move, and a ballet move. Awesome, awesome. But first, before we do that, we have to go warm up and stretch, okay? Oh yeah, makes sense. Where do we do that? Follow me. Oh, okay, follow Mr. Christian. Oh, I'm so excited to get started. Me too. All right, first, we're going to warm up. Oh. It's so important to warm up your body before you dance, get your muscles loose and warmed up so you don't get hurt. Absolutely, all right? So first, we're going to run in place and count to eight. Oh yeah, you count to eight in dance because you can easily break up the sections in music when you're learning dance moves. And you don't have to count too high. Absolutely, all right, ready? Okay. Go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 Stop. Oh, I'm already warming up. Awesome, all right, so next thing, we're gonna do our pizza stretch, okay? I love pizza. Me too, okay? Okay. So we gotta go into our straddle, we're gonna sit on the ground, we're gonna go into our straddle, we're okay. gonna spread our legs out. All right, you can sit on the ground too. All right, and we're going to roll our dough out, so we're gonna roll our dough, and we're going to pat, 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 all around, pat, 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 pat. There you go, and then we're going to pour our sauce, all around, Ooh. and then we're gonna spread our sauce, spread our sauce, 
awesome, awesome. And then we're going to sprinkle our cheese. Ooh. Sprinkle our and cheese. if you're dairy free, you can use dairy free cheese. Cheese with no dairy. There you go. And then we're going to put our toppings. So I'm going to put chicken on mine because I okay, love chicken. Okay, I'm going to put some mushrooms and ooh, green pepper. Ooh, I'm going to put some pineapples on ooh, there. Mm -hmm. That sounds yummy. Yeah. All right. And then we're going to put our other mittens on. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Protect Just, ourselves. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to take the pizza. We're going to put it in the oven. So we're going to open the oven door. We're going to put the pizza in there. We're going to close the door. And then we're going to count to eight. Okay. Ready? We're going to go one, two, two three, four, four, five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Ding, 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 ding. It's ready. Fast cooking pizza. Yeah. So we're going to take it out, open the door. Take out the pizza. All right, ready? And three, two, one. No, 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 Awesome, awesome. All right, and we're gonna put our feet together. Okay. And that's our final warm up. We're gonna put our feet together. All right, and we're gonna say hi, toes. Hi, toes. Goodbye, toes. Goodbye, toes. Hi, toes. Hi, toes. Goodbye, toes. Goodbye, toes. Hi, toes. Hi, toes. I quickly grab them before they go away. Wait. We're gonna count yeah. to eight. One, One two, two, three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, seven, eight. eight. Yay! Oh, I feel really good now and warmed up. Awesome. I'm well, ready to dance. You ready? Let's mm -hmm. go. Okay, come on, let's go learn some dance moves. Whoa! We are in a real dance studio. This is awesome. I can't believe you are gonna teach me hip hop moves, break dance moves, and ballet moves. You know a lot about dance. What do you love most about it? There's just so many things about dance I love, but a few things that I love are that I can use one side of my mind, which is the logic side, and the other side of my mind, which is the creative side, and put them together through my movements. Also that it's a form of self-expression. Oh, yeah. So you can really express yourself through the movements, and also it's a sense of community. It's really about love and sharing that with everyone. Oh, that's so cool. I also like to express myself through music and dance, it's such a fun way to just be yourself and let loose and have fun. Yeah. <laughs> and you especially do that in hip hop, right? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Oh, what are the hip hop moves we're gonna learn? Okay, so our first move is our step touch, step touch. Okay. And when we do that, we're gonna count to eight, okay? Oh you yeah, ready? count to eight, I remember. All right, so first, we gotta step out with our right foot. Okay. One, and step together, two. Mm -hmm. And step out with your left, one. Step together, two. And then repeat Step, that. Yep. Touch. I did. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Step touch. Okay. So we're gonna do that a little faster. Okay. Okay. Ready? Yep. Five, six, seven, eight. One, One two, two, three, four, five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Good job. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> awesome. All right. So next, we're gonna do the same thing. Okay. But we're gonna add arms to make it look really cool. Whoa. You ready? Okay. All right. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two. two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. Wow, that did look yeah. cool. <laughs> awesome. All right, so after that, we're gonna do our top rock. And oh. our top rock is a really cool move because it's the basic move for break dancing. Okay, so we are learning a basic move of break dance. So yeah. awesome. <laughs> okay, so first, you're gonna take your right arm. Okay. So right hand over, and then your left hand under. Whoop. Okay? Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna step out with your right foot, then okay. your heels gonna point up to the sky. And then our arms are gonna go out like you're about to give a big hug. Oh yeah, big yeah. hug. Okay? And then we're gonna repeat it to the other side. We're gonna step out with the right, we're gonna put, we're gonna switch our hands over, left over, right under, and then we're gonna kick out with our left foot, and our toes point up at the sky again, and we're gonna make a big hug one more time. Ah, Ooh, big there you go. Good job. Nice. You think we can do it a little faster? Yeah, let's try All it. Right. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, two three, four, five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Yes, oh, good so job. Fun. Thank yeah. you. All right, and our next move to make a little more flavor and Ooh, put our first on it, yes. we're gonna do a crisscross. Criss you ready? Crisscross, what's that? Okay, 
So it's pretty, pretty simple. Okay. So your feet are kind of shoulder width apart. Okay. And think of it like a scissor. Okay. okay. You're like you're chopping paper. Okay. You know, so you're gonna go cross with your right over your left. I know it's a little confusing, but we'll go through very slow. Okay. okay. We're gonna go right foot. Shoot. Shoot. And we're gonna cross. Shoot. Oh, it is like yeah. scissors. Like you're and, cutting yeah. paper. Exactly. And then we're gonna switch it to switch feet. So you're gonna go left or right. Ready? Mm -hmm. Five, six, seven, eight. And switch. Yeah, there you go. Do a little faster. Okay. All right, ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Yes, good job. <laughs> Thank you. That's awesome. All right, after that, we're gonna move into our ballet. Oh yeah, I really love that ballet. Yeah. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put our feet together. Okay. Okay. And we're gonna put our heels turned out. Okay. You see your toes or heels are kissing each other and going okay. mwah. Awesome. And we're gonna put our arms into our beach ball like this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright. And we're gonna count, we're gonna count to eight one more time. So we're gonna go. One, two, two, three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, seven eight. eight. Good job. Okay. Awesome. And that is called our plie. Oh, and that means to bend in French. There you go. So we're gonna do it just a little bit faster. Is that okay? Okay. All right. Five, six, seven, eight. One, One two, two, three, four, four five, six, six, seven, eight. eight. Good job. Great. Thank you. Awesome. Okay. And then to add a little more spice flavor to Love our it. ballet, uh -huh. we're gonna do some tendus, okay? Oh, and tendu means to stretch in French. There you go. So we're gonna do our tendus to the side. We're gonna start on our right side. We're gonna do it four times. And we're gonna go one with our right toe out. Uh -huh. And we're just gonna bring it in. Boop, boop. One more time. Out, boop. Bring it in. Boop. Out, boop. Out. Bring it in. Out. Out. In. In. Good job. Thank you. You're welcome. And now we're going to go to the other side, okay? Okay. So our hands are still on your hips like this. Mm -hmm. And you're going to go out with your left foot. Out. And then bring it. And you're going to go out. Out. And bring it. In. And you're going to go out. Bring it. Out. Bring it. Oh, Good job. Thank you. Wow. Can we do a little faster? Yeah, let's try right. it. Ready? Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yay! Good job! Thank you for teaching me all of those moves. Of course, of course. Are you ready to put it all together? I think so. All right. It's going to be a little faster. It might be a little challenging, but I think we can do it. I think so too. All right. You ready? Yep. All right. We're going to start with the step touch. You ready? Yes. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Arms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Top row. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Criss cross. Two, three, dance it out. Six, seven, eight. Criss cross. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Plie. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Tendu. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Can we freestyle and express ourselves however we want? Absolutely, that's the point of dance, absolutely. Oh, awesome. I think I'm ready to do a performance. <gasps> I'm so excited, I can't wait. Okay, All right. let's do let's it. Let's do it, let's okay. do it. You lead the way. All right, let's go. <laughs> Come on. Introducing the wonderful, talented, and unique Mika. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, hello.
Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, that was so good. <laughs> Thank you for teaching me all of those new dance moves. Of course, it's my pleasure. <laughs> You're a great teacher. Oh, thanks. Well, I'll see you later. All right. Thanks, Mr. Christian. You're see welcome. ya. Bye. Wow, we had so much fun today and really learned a lot. We learned about warming up our bodies and staying loose when we learn new dance moves. And speaking of dance moves, we learn new hip hop moves, break dance moves, and ballet moves. And we did a great job counting to eight. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <sighs> awesome. M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. All right, we'll see you next time. Keep dancing. <laughs> Hi, it's me, Mika, and today I'm at the Gingerbread Factory in Leavenworth, Washington. This place is so cool because they're known for making gingerbread. Have you ever had a gingerbread cookie before? Oh, they're so yummy, and I love it when they have icing on them. I want to know how icing is made, and I bet I can find out in here. Come on. <gasps> Whoa, look at all of these delicious looking desserts. Hmm, but that's not the icing I'm talking about. Oh, look at these cookies, yum. But you don't have any icing on them. Hmm. Let's keep going. Whoa! <laughs> Look how big that cinnamon roll is. Ooh, and that has yummy icing on it. And these cookies, they're shaped like hearts. Oh, they're so cute. I really like this pink one with rainbow sprinkles. That's the kind of icing I want to make. <laughs> Hello. Hello there. I'm Mika, what's your name? I'm Ashley. Oh, nice to meet you, Ashley. You too. Are you a baker? I sure am. Oh, so I bet you know how to make icing. The sugary good stuff? Yes, that's my favorite. I sure do. Do you want to know how to? Yes, please. All right, come with me. Oh, awesome, let's go. I'm so excited. Okay. <laughs> so before we get to creating in the kitchen, we've got to wash our hands. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's get our hands clean. So excited to make icing. Okay, so first things first, get some soap. Wash my hands. It's important to have clean hands when you're baking or cooking so you don't get any germs in the ingredients. Keep everything nice and clean. All right. Whoa, that's a lot of I don't know what. <laughs> yeah, so friend, this is 10 pounds powdered sugar, the first ingredient to making icing. That's a ton of sugar. Yeah. Do you want to dump it in the bowl so we can get started? Oh, sure. Okay. Oh, do I need to wear anything special? Oh, you're so right. We're going to have our apron. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Okay. This way we can keep all of the messes off of our clothes. Mm, so right. Okay. So the first thing is gonna be the powdered sugar in this big bowl. Oh yeah. Okay. Whoa. Oh, it's heavy. Good Whoa. job. Looks like snow. Whoa. <laughs> Perfect. Look at this. Yeah. Now it's snowing in the kitchen. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, there's still some more. There's more. Mm-hmm. All right. Oof, sorry for the mess, Ashley. Oh, you look great. <laughs> the next ingredient is meringue powder. Whoa, what is that for? That's to make the sugar whip together into icing. Whoa, okay. Maybe this will make such a big mess. Mm. Oh no, that was much better. Yeah. <laughs> Last but not least, we need the water to liquefy it. Oh, okay, the whole thing? The whole thing. Some water. Yeah. This is gonna make a lot of icing. Mm-hmm. And so I don't have a poof on me. <laughs> We're gonna have you mix that up till it's nice and liquidy. Whoa! We need some big muscles to mix all this icing together. <laughs> Oh, I can smell it. It smells really sweet. 
Mm-hmm. Round and round, get all the ingredients together. Okay, is that good? I think that's looking pretty good. Okay. All right. <laughs> Want to give that a little ting ting? Okay, a little, a couple of tings. Uh -huh. <laughs> a few more. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to put this guy onto our lovely machine and we're going to get to mixing until it's nice and wet. Wow, okay. Yeah. Wow. This machine is so cool. And so helpful. Yeah, it's gonna mix everything together to make a really nice, smooth icing. Mm-hmm. Those grandmas before had to do it all by hand. Wow. One, two, three. Whoa. It's so cool, come look. Just in time, it just got done. Oh, yes! Yeah, so actually, you want to learn how to make a decorating poem? Yeah, that sounds so cool! All right, awesome. I'm so glad to hear that. So we got this bowl. Okay. All right, and there's a spoon already in there. Do you want to Ooh. scoop a couple of heaping spoonfuls Ooh, out? Heaping, heaping. Yeah. That means big. Okay. Oh. Whoa. Yeah. Look at that! Some more in there. Mm -hmm. Wow, we made a lot of icing. Okay. Whoa. Perfect. Nice and fluffy. Mm. Look at that. <laughs> okay. Okay. So next, you're going to take one of these bags. Okay. And you're going to fold it so we can hold it without getting our hands fold dirty. Fold it so you can hold it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now what? Perfect. You're going to hold it just like a cup. And here's your tip. Oh, thank you. This is what helps us push the icing through. Oh. And we're gonna slide it right on in, all okay. the way to the bottom. Like that. Perfect. Now you're gonna take your spoon and just put a couple of spoonfuls in there. <laughs> Not right. too much. Oh no, I'm gonna get messy again. It's okay. It's fun to get messy. Woo! <laughs> all right. Nice catch. Thank you, thank you. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Should I start squeezing it down? Push it down just a little. Push it down just a little. With it still folded? Fold it up. Okay. Fold it yeah. up. Yeah. Perfect. I'm gonna steal some too, so we're on the same page. Push it down. Yeah. See it? And I'm gonna do just a little. How's oh, that? Did great. Yeah. So to make sure it doesn't all come out the top, mm -hmm. we have these lovely little clips. Oh, yeah. so you can fold it down. Fold it up. Fold it up. And around. Oh. Yeah, and then we push down. Push, push, push. Oh, perfect. Okay. Here's your lovely little clip. Thank you. Here's my lovely little clip, and we clip it on. Awesome, we're ready That's... to decorate now. All right, let's do it. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah. Look at all of this. I see candy. We could decorate with candy. And oh, there's so many different kinds of cookies. Wow, look at this. A little person. It's so cute. And oh, do you know what color this is? It's one of my favorites. Purple. It's a purple rectangle. And oh, look at this really bright circle. It's orange. <laughs> Ooh, and here's one of my other favorite colors. Do you know what it is? Yellow. Nice. Kind of looks like a sunshine. And a blue square. Look at that. These colors are so bright and cool. And there's little circles. Look, they could be eyeballs. Hello. <laughs> All right, what should I decorate first? Hmm. Ashley, what do you think? Oh, well, if you don't want to use white, I made all these extra colors for you. You did? I did. Wow. I see purple and yellow yeah. and blue. Wow. Okay, let's see. I think 
I'm going to make a little person. <laughs> Maybe I'll use purple because I love it so much. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna do a purple shirt. And yellow pants. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's so cute. And maybe some white curly hair. <laughs> and let's see. I'm going to do a blue face. Eyes and a smile. <laughs> it kind of looks like my grandma. <laughs> Yummy. Woo. And maybe I'll decorate this one with a big yellow. See if you know what this is. letter M for Mika. <laughs> oh, this is so fun. And it really makes it easier to decorate in these bags. Makes it easier to write things. <laughs> Look at that funny cookie. <laughs> You know who this is? Huh? <laughs> That's right, it's me, Mika! <laughs> this is so much fun decorating these cookies. Oh, hey, hey Ashley! Hey friend. Hey. How'd you like decorating today? Oh, I love it, it's so much fun. And I made you a little something. Oh. I'm getting pretty good at decorating. Do you know who this is? It's you. That's right, and I made it just for you. Wow, thank you. You're welcome, and I also made, do you know? It's Blippi. <laughs> That's right, my best friend Blippi. I made this for you too. <gasps> thank you so much. Well, thank you yeah. so much for teaching me how to make icing. Anytime, friend. Oh, I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs> wow, this has been so cool learning how to make icing and how to decorate cookies. Look, hello, hello, we're best friends. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Great, M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. All right, we'll see you soon, bye. Bye-bye! <laughs> hey everyone, it's me, Mika, and today I'm at Sky Zone Trampoline Park in Anaheim, California. <laughs> Ooh, look at these blocks! They're so fun and light. They're made out of foam. And look, this one is orange, and oh, there's a blue one there too. And it says, Welcome! <laughs> That's so nice! I'm really excited because there are trampolines here and foam pits that you can jump into. And I really want to learn how to do a flip. I wonder if there's someone here who can teach me how to do that. Let's go find out. Hi, Mika. Hi, I'm Priscilla. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Welcome to Sky Zone. Ooh, thank you. I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> awesome. Okay, first we do need to pick out some wristbands Ooh, in order to go inside the park. I love wristbands. Hmm. So which color would you like? Oh, let's see. There's orange, green, <gasps> yellow. Yellow is one of my favorite colors. I Mine want this one. too. All right, here, let's go. Thank you, so official. <laughs> and now we have to pick out some socks. Okay, why do we need to put on special socks? The special socks have grip on them so that when you're on the trampoline, you don't slip. Oh, that's so smart. Hmm, let's see, we have some orange socks and, ooh, 
some blue and black and pink socks. Hmm, I think I'm gonna go with the orange. I love this color and my best friend Flippy really loves orange. I'm gonna wear these. All right, perfect. <laughs> Thank so you. what brings you in today? Oh, I really wanna learn how to do a flip on the trampoline. All right, perfect. We have Quincy in the park who can teach you how to do a flip. Wow, okay, let's go find Quincy. Thank you. Of course. <laughs> trampolines and this huge foam pit behind me. Wow, I've never seen so many trampolines before. Will you count them with me? Awesome, let's go. Okay, ready? One, <laughs> two, three, four, five. Wow, five trampolines! Huh, I wonder where Quincy is. That's who's supposed to teach me how to do a flip. Oh, I'm so excited. Where is he though? I wonder if he's in the foam pit. Should I jump in and see? <laughs> Let's do it. Woo, wow. <laughs> Quincy. Quincy? Hmm. Quincy! I don't think anyone's in here, except me. <laughs> Whoa, it says foam zone. That's where we are in this big foam zone. Check out these blocks. Look, you see a square? When there's six squares together, that makes a cube. And these are made out of foam, so it's soft and squishy, so it feels really fun and nice to jump into a foam pit. And you don't get hurt. <laughs> Look, there's orange, blue, and black. <laughs> this is so fun. I can't wait till I learn how to do a flip. I wonder where Quincy is. <gasps> Maybe he's over there. Come on, let's go look. Whoa, this is cool. But I still don't see Quincy anywhere. Huh. Whoa. I know what this is. It's orange, it's round, and oh, it bounces. This is a basketball. But why would a basketball be at a trampoline park? Hey. There's a basketball hoop <laughs> and another trampoline. I bet jumping on a trampoline and throwing a basketball into the hoop is a lot easier than if you're just on a regular ground. Oh, I'm gonna try it. Okay, let's see. On three. One, two, three. Ah, didn't get it in. Oh, here's another one. It's yellow. Maybe I'll try and throw it. Words. One, two, three. Whoa. Oh, whoopsie. <laughs> oh, there's another one. Hmm. Maybe if I do three big bounces to the hoop, that will go in. Ready? One, two, three. Ah, there's one more ball. Okay, how should I do this one? Hmm. Maybe. I'll do one giant bounce and a turn for finesse. <laughs> Ready? One. Oh, I still didn't get it in. <laughs> That's okay. I'm gonna keep looking for Quincy. I can't wait to learn how to do a flip. <sighs> Quincy! No, Quincy. <laughs> Let's go over to the other side. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Do you know what this is? This is a balance beam. It's called that because it's a beam 
and you have to have really good balance to stand on it. Whew, you don't want to wobble and go side to side. Did you know that there are a lot of animals who have really good balance? And mostly because of their tails. <laughs> Squirrels have really good balance because of their swooshy tails. And cats, meow, meow. <laughs> and kangaroos. Yeah, kangaroos have long tails that help them balance. And they're really good jumpers. <laughs> Will you jump with me? <laughs> hey, let's jump over there. Woo! Oh, more trampolines! Look how many are in here! Whoa! Wow! That has to be Quincy! He's so good at jumping! Whoa! Whoa! Wow! Are you Hello? Quincy? I am Quincy. Hi, I'm Mika! It's nice to meet you, Mika. How nice you doing? To meet you too. I'm so much fun here. Oh, I'm so glad to hear that, Mika. So I heard that you are really good at flipping. You might have heard right. Oh, well, I want to learn how to flip too. Can oh, you help me? I can take good care of you. Oh, awesome. <laughs> what do we need to do first? All right, first and foremost, we have to warm up. Oh, right. It's important to warm up our body so we don't get hurt. Exactly, Mika. Okay, so what do we need to do? So first things first, you know, we're just going to touch the ground. Oh, okay. We're just touch, touch the, the ground. ground. Oh. You know, then we're gonna lean to the left, and then we're gonna lean it to the right. Okay. Ah. And you know, once your legs feel all good, you get some jumping jacks in. Woo! You know, you know, have some fun with it. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> wow, it's kind of like making a snow angel in the air. Exactly. Whoa! <laughs> Wow. Okay, I'm feeling pretty good. I'm getting warmer and looser. Are right, you feeling warm and loose? I think so. All right, let's see if you can do a jump twist then. Whoa, a jump twist. Okay, ready? Whoa, like okay. that? Just like that. Wow. Right. I got what else one can we do? Well, you ever done a somersault? Yeah, have you ever done a somersault before? Okay, let's do it together. All right, you know how to do a somersault, Mika? Yeah. So what are the first steps, just first as a steps, reminder? Visualize your platform. Ooh, okay. Visualize. Then you're gonna put your hands out. Okay. Oh. And fall. Okay, so hands out, and what do I do with my head? You're gonna tuck your head in like a bowling ball. Oh, tuck your head in like a bowling ball. You're gonna tuck. And roll. And then become the ball. Become the ball. <laughs> Here I go. Whoa! <laughs> Just like that, Mika. That was so fun. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Okay, ready? All right. Visualize. Visualize. Head tucked. Head tucked. And become the ball. Become the ball. Oh, whoa! <laughs> that was really fun. It was really fun. Now I got a question for you. Yeah. Think you can do it in the air? Oh, I've never tried before. You want me to show you? Yes, please. All right. But first, you're going to get a whole lot of air. Whoa. Whole lot of air. And then, next you're gonna do, you tuck your chin again. So once you get all that air, you're gonna tuck your chin. And remember, only try and do a flip if you're with a grown up. Whoa, did you see that? He just did a front flip in the air. That was amazing. <laughs> ah, thank you. How do you jump that high? Uh, <sighs> basketball helps. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Sometimes, you just gotta have fun with it in the air. Hop over your leg. Wow! You're so good Meditate at jumping! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! Wow! That was so fun! But Quincy, I don't know if I'm ready to do a flip in the air like you just did. Well, you gotta keep practicing, Mika, and then you'll get it. I got it. So, I have to remember to jump really high, stay in one spot, tuck my head, and go forward like a ball. Exactly, it's just like a somersault, but you're taking away the ground. Got it, thank you so much. Of course, Mika. I'm gonna take all of these things and I'm gonna practice and then one day I'll get to do a front flip just like you, Quincy. I hope so, Mika. <laughs> thank you so much. Of course, I'm gonna go bounce now. All right, me too, see you later. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> wow, 
That was so much fun playing and bouncing at Sky Zone Trampoline Park. <laughs> I really wanted to learn how to do a flip today, and Quincy was an amazing teacher. He knows a lot about flipping and bouncing on trampolines. Oh, and it was so fun jumping into the foam pit. The foam pit was nice and soft and squishy and oh, made out of blocks like this. Wait a second. Do you know what this says? It says, Mika. <laughs> That's me. That's my name. Well, I had so much fun playing and learning with you today. If you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Awesome. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. We'll see you next time. Bye. Today I'm at Munchkin's Indoor Playground in Los Angeles, California. This place is so awesome because you get to move your body and have a lot of fun and we get to play a game today. Come on! Whoa! This place is amazing! It's slide time! Meet you at the bottom. And I landed in a ball pit! Whoa! Ball pits are so fun! Ooh, and I like all of these colors. Let's see. Pink. <laughs> and there's blue. And white. There's so much you can do in a ball pit. You can dance. You could juggle. Whoa, I only know how to juggle two balls. I don't know how to do three yet. I have to keep practicing. <laughs> hey, look over here. Whoa, at the very top, it looks like a big scoop of ice cream or maybe a marshmallow or something. Oh, and there's a cool looking pattern on it. White, blue, white, blue, white, blue, white, blue, all the way around. Oh, I like that. Ooh, let's go inside. Ooh. Hello. <laughs> oh, this is a fun little space. Hmm. Whoa, look at this. This ball has words on it. Oh, let's read it. Go to the slide for an item to catch and find the play area that looks like it's match. A match, that means that it looks the same. Hmm. Hey, looks like we get to exercise our bodies and our minds. <laughs> this is gonna be a really good game for the mind. Hmm, go to the slide. There must be another slide here. Let's go find it. Oh, this has to be the other slide. I wonder what's gonna happen here that will help me play the game. <gasps> Look! Whoa, have you seen this before? It's a stethoscope. Maybe you've seen one at the doctor's office? Yeah, a doctor will use this to listen to your heartbeat. Oh yeah, nice and healthy. <laughs> I wonder if there's a doctor center around here. Let's go find out. Hmm, I wonder where this stethoscope goes. Oh, look at this cool thing. Oh, hello. Oh, let's look up here. Hmm. I don't think this is where our stethoscope belongs. <laughs> it's really fun though. Whoa. Hmm. <gasps> hey, look, mini clinic. We found it. This is a doctor's office. The stethoscope definitely belongs there. Come on. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, hello, welcome. Do you have an appointment? You're, oh, yep, you're right there. Come on in. <laughs> Doctors and nurses are so cool and very important. They take care of us and make sure we're feeling nice and healthy. They check your heartbeat, see what kind of tools are in here. Ooh, they'll probably look at your eyes and look inside your ears. <laughs> and sometimes they have you stick your tongue out and say, ah. Ooh, and look, there's some glasses. 
Ooh, one of my favorite colors too, yellow. And look, you can dress up like a doctor. So official. And a little hat. Cool, how do I look? Dr. Mika. <laughs> okay, so this is definitely where the stethoscope goes. Okay, let's just clean up and go back to the slide. Come on. I'm so excited to see what the next item is. <gasps> Here it comes. Whoa. <gasps> Do you know what this is? It's a tomato. Ooh, one of my favorites. Yum. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if there's a grocery store or something here. Let's go look. <gasps> Whoa. A carousel. Ooh. Look at this nice orange one. Let's get on. Oh, hello, horsey. I'm Mika. Hmm. I wonder how this thing works. That's not it. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Whoa, this is fun. Hey, what a cool way to look for a space where the tomato belongs. Hmm, let me know if you see something. <gasps> right there. A supermarket. This is definitely where the tomato belongs. Hey, look down here, more food. Yeah, a supermarket or a grocery store is where you can buy food, like a tomato. Hmm, what are some other red foods? <gasps> Ooh, what about this red pepper? Yummy. Hmm, oh, here's another red pepper. And, oh, I love this red food, strawberries. I'm gonna have a red meal. Hmm. Ooh, more strawberries. And an apple. Okay, now I have all of my food. I have to pay for it. Let's go inside. Come on. Okay. Oh. All right, let's see. Oh, I guess I can ring up my own items. Hmm. All right, bell pepper. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, interesting. <laughs> strawberries. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> okay. More strawberries. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, now we're cooking. Pepper. Beep, beep, beep. Ooh. Apple. Beep, beep, beep. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And tomato. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, yeah. Now we're grooving. How am I gonna pay for this food? I don't know, but I'm in a good mood. <laughs> oh, it looks like I have a credit card here. Let's see, my grand total is $6. Okay, let's see. Okay, that worked. All right, don't need any change. I think I'm done here. <laughs> okay, so the tomato is with the food. Good job matching with me. Hey, let's go back to the slide and see what else comes down. Come on. I'm having so much fun. I wonder what the next item will be. Whoa, look at this. A firefighter helmet. Yeah, firefighters will wear a helmet like this to protect their heads when they're fighting fires. Huh, I wonder what kind of area would have a firefighter helmet. <laughs> let's go find out. Whoa, did you find where the firefighter helmet belongs? <laughs> Good job, looks like a match. See, there's a fire truck and firefighters drive fire trucks to where the fire is to put it out and save the day. <laughs> this is a really cool truck. Oh, see the big ladder and ooh, a walkie talkie. <laughs> firefighter Mika here, over. <laughs> Yes, that is correct. Everything is fine here. Yes, have a good day. Okay, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And look, here's where the siren is so people know that a fire truck is on the way. It sounds like Something like that. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'll put this firefighter helmet here. That way, if someone wants to play, they can be the driver and wear the firefighter helmet and look like a real firefighter. <laughs> Let's go back to the slide and see what the next item is. Come on.
Yes! So far, so good! And I think there's another item about to come down. Whoa! Oh, that was fast! Ooh, what is this, Gouda? <laughs> That's kind of cheese. One of my favorites. <laughs> oh! Do you know what letter that is? It's the first letter of the alphabet. <laughs> That's right, the letter A. Hmm, I wonder if there are more letters around here. Let's go look. Okay, I have the letter A. I wonder if there are any other letters around. Hmm. Oh, I see letters in there. Let's go inside. Oh, whoa, it's a trampoline. <laughs> All right, let's see. I have the letter A, and there's B, C, D. This is definitely where the letter A goes. Hey, I know what we could do. We could think of an animal that begins with the letter A, and then we could act it out. <laughs> hmm. I have one. Ant eater. <laughs> Can you act like an ant eater? They do, in fact. Eat ants. They have really long nose and mouth, and they go around and they look for ants. Any ants over here? Nom 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 nom. Any ants over here? Nom 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 nom. Hey, give me that ant back. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> oh, and the next letter, the letter B. Ooh, I know one. A bat. Let's act like bats together. Bats begin with the letter B. Spread your wings and fly like a bat, or jump. Whoa. Kind of feels like I'm flying for real. <laughs> and the letter C. Cat begins with the letter C. Hmm, how can we act like cat? Get your little paws out and meow, 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 meow. Whoa, calm down, cat. Calm down, cat. What about the letter D? The animal starts with the letter D. <gasps> dog! Can you act like a dog with me? Okay. <laughs> Good job! Now you can just jump and bounce and have, whoa, fun! <laughs> hey, bounce begins with the letter B. <laughs> Let's go back to the slide and see if there are any more items. Come on. Whoa, these slides are so cool. I wonder if anything else will slide down. Oh, look, it's one of the ball pit balls. I wonder if we need to go to the other ball pit. Whoa. Oh yeah, we definitely need to go to the other ball pit. Let's go. Okay, let's go find that ball pit. Come on. Whoa, a big white slide. Oh, I have to go down. Ready? Three, two, one. Woo! Whoa, that was so fast. Do you see the ball pit? It's behind me. Whoa, let's find a fun way to get into it. Hello. Whoa, look at this. It's a big slide. All right, I'm going down. See you at the bottom. Whoa. <laughs> I love that there are two ball pits in this indoor playground. Whoa. Oh, we just swim on over. <laughs> Ooh, this is so fun. And this is definitely where the white ball belongs. There you go. <laughs> hey, look at this wall. See the two colors, pink and blue? And it makes a pattern, see? Pink, blue, pink, blue. Do you know what the next color is? <laughs> That's right, pink. Hey, look at that little car. It's so cute. And there's three more ball pit balls. There's a pink one, and a white one, and a blue one. And there's words on this one. Let's see. You've finished the game, now count all you've done. 
Then go down the slide for some extra fun. <gasps> Whoa, that means we finished the game. We did it, we did it. We really, really did it. Oh, awesome. Okay, it says count all you've done. Do you remember the items that we found? Okay, we found the stethoscope, the tomato, the firefighter helmet, the letter A, and a ball pit ball. Will you count the items with me? <laughs> Great. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. And then it says, go down the slide for some extra fun. <laughs> well, let's go down the slide. Come on. Yes, now it's my turn to go down the slide. Will you count down with me? <laughs> okay, three, two, one. Woo! Whoa! <laughs> Wow, that was so much fun. Hey, we figured everything out. We did it. We did it. We did it. Oh, yeah, we did it. Let's go. High five. <laughs> nice job. Thank you so much for helping me with that matching game. We exercised our minds by figuring out which play center matches which item, and we exercise our bodies by running around this indoor playground. <laughs> That was a lot of fun. And thank you for learning with me. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Cake Bash Studio in Lake Balboa, California. They have so many fun cakes to decorate here. And maybe I'll get to do some decorating of my own. Come on. Whoa, check out all these delicious treats. Hmm, I wonder what they all are. Oh, hey, look at this treat right here. That's called Tres Leches. Oh, and look, don't these look delicious? Those are cake pops. They kind of look like balloons. <laughs> Can you pretend to hold a balloon and float away? Ooh, wow. <laughs> oh, and check out this. Do you know the shape? That's right, it's a square. Hmm, do you know what fruit this is made out of? <laughs> yeah, it's a lemon bar made out of lemons. Whoa, so many delicious things here. Yum. Look at these cakes. Oh, I really like how they're decorated. Look. Do you know what kind of animal that is? <laughs> That's right. It's a bunny rabbit. Let's pretend to be bunny rabbits. Huff, 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 huff. <laughs> Whoa. It looks like maybe they had a little bit too much carrot cake. <laughs> Oh, and look at this one. Oh, it looks lovely. Do you see the shapes on this cake? Do you know what it is? <laughs> yeah, they're hearts, just like this one. <laughs> All right, I'm supposed to be decorating cakes too. Oh, I see someone over there. Maybe they can help me decorate a cake like this one. Come on, let's go. Hey. I'm Mika, nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you. My name is Moretis. how can I assist you? Moretis, I would love to decorate a cake. Oh, you came to the perfect place. <laughs> That's what we do. So any idea you may have, we can turn it into a cake. Hmm, I'm not sure how I want to decorate my cake yet. Mm, well, we have plenty of inspiration, so Ooh. take some time to look around and I'll meet you in the back so we can get started. Great. All right. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. Whoa! Look at all these cakes. Hmm. They're all different sizes and they're decorated differently too. Time to get some inspiration. Inspiration is when you're getting ideas that make you want to create. <laughs> Let's check out these cakes. <gasps> Whoa. Look, a unicorn cake with a beautiful rainbow on it. <laughs> so colorful. And check it out. Wow. This is called fondant, and you can use it to create all kinds of different shapes on cakes, like clouds and flowers and different shapes. <laughs> Uh-oh, it looks like rain. Oh, 
showers. <laughs> Let me get my umbrella. <laughs> so cute. Did you know that you can't have a rainbow without rain? Uh-huh, that's right. And look over here. These cakes, they all have different toppers. This is called a topper because it's at the top of the cake. Oh, and there's a rabbit topper and a topper with a word. Do you know what this says? <laughs> it says love. Let's spell it. L-O-V-E, -E, love. <laughs> oh, and check it out. The bunny rabbit has a little heart nose. <laughs> Oh, I got an idea. Let's turn on this radio and have a 10 second dance party. Ready? Bloop, 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 bloop. I love cake. Cake is great. I love cake, cause it makes me wanna wiggle and shake. <laughs> okay, I feel all inspired and I'm ready to decorate. Let's go. <laughs> Hello again. Oh, hi Mika. Did you get any inspiration? Yes, I have a lot of great ideas. Awesome. So here, we're gonna get some embellishments that you can add to your cake. And after that, you're gonna meet me at the cake decorating station, okay? Great. <laughs> but first, let's grab your apron. Whoa. Baker and Mika. Thank you. <laughs> cool, I have an apron. I'm Baker Mika, ready to decorate. <laughs> first, let me tie my apron up. Check out all these embellishments. Embellishments are little details you can add to a cake. Whoa, and look, there are so many different types of colors and shapes. Hmm, I'd like to put this on my cake. <laughs> Do you know what these are? <laughs> yeah, bananas. Mm, they're yellow, just like one of my favorite colors. Okay, oh, speaking of favorite colors, Oh, yeah, my other favorite color. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, I should get out some embellishments of Blippi's favorite colors. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I need blue and orange. Oh, check it out. Blue and orange. What do we have here? <gasps> some pumpkins. Oh, and lots of blue sprinkles. Do you hear that? That's such a cool sound. It's like a maraca. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I like to decorate cakes. <laughs> so cool. Okay, let's grab some more. Hmm. Oh, look at this. Kind of look like mermaid tails. Cool. I'd like some of those, please. And... Get out, these are metallic. <laughs> Some of those, and hmm. Oh, look, this kind of looks like snow. <laughs> That's pretty neat too. I just washed my hands, I have my embellishments, and I'm ready to start. Awesome, so now we're gonna work in some fondant. Okay. Okay, so we can create some decorations for the cake. Great. You're gonna take the amount of fun that you wanna use, roll it so you can smooth it out. Okay. And then you're gonna roll. Roll it? Yes. It's kinda like a ball. Hey, I could even juggle with these. <laughs> there you go, your rolling Ooh, pin. Ooh, my rolling pin. Now I'm gonna roll it out. So it's nice and smooth and flat. Yeah, one smooth Ooh. motion. <laughs> Thank you. It's kind of like clay. Okay. All right, you're ready. So now you're gonna choose your cutter. Huh, I'd like to choose this flower. You Place gonna that there. press it and wiggle. Press and wiggle. Now can I pull away this extra yes. fondant? Okay, let's pull this part away. Check it out, a beautiful flower. Ooh, maybe it's a daisy, maybe it's a sunflower or a rose. Great, we'll put it right there. 
Can I make one out of blue fondant now? Of course. So now, roll it. Roll it up just like a ball. Move it out. What's this? Cornstarch. This helps you for it to, for the fondant to not stick to the surface. Oh, okay. Good to know. Now you're ready to roll. Ready to roll. <laughs> Ooh, I like this color blue. How's that? All right, I think that's good. Okay, so now what shape are you gonna use? Hmm, let's do a car. <laughs> Awesome. Now remember, press and wiggle, wiggle. Press and wiggle. Great! Oh, that looks awesome! Oh, I just remembered. I have some cutters in my jam pack. Oh, awesome. Let's do those. I have a bow tie for my best friend, Blippi. <laughs> and, oh, a T-Rex! Can you roar with me like a T-Rex? <gasps> roar! You too. <laughs> roar! <laughs> okay, I want to do the T-Rex next. All right. There you go. <laughs> a blue T-Rex. That is funny. Ooh. Hello, T-Rex. <gasps> We can see his bones and everything. All right. That looks great. Could be a bow tie or a hair bow. Okay, I'd like to finish with this truck. Honk, honk. Edge this out, edge this out. <laughs> there you go. And here we can use that. Oh yeah. Thing so see it didn't cut through completely. You can cut it out. Perfect. There. there you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, let's wheel you over, truck. Honk. Honk honk. Alright, so now that we're done with fondant, we're gonna be working with frosting. This is our American buttercream, and we have our food coloring. These are primary colors. Yellow, red. And blue. When you mix certain primary colors, you make secondary colors, like purple and orange. Oh, I've got it. I'd like to make purple and orange. All right, so let's do it. Okay, let's scoop in our frosting. All right, so in order to make orange, I'd like to mix yellow and red. Perfect. Now to make purple, I will mix <gasps> red and blue. There we go. Okay, time to stir. Wow, it's turning orange. It's turning purple. <laughs> Great. That looks delicious. All right, so here's your cake. Now you have everything you need so that you can make your creation. If you need anything else, just let me know. I'll be in the back. Thank you. All right, you're very welcome. Bye, Meredith. Bye, nice to meet you. <laughs> okay, let's start to decorate. Woo, I'm excited. Okay, gonna put on my truck. Let's put on our car next. Oh, and look at this. It's a turntable. <laughs> Spin, spin, spin. Oh, I want to put my flower on top. Hmm, where should my T-Rex go? Rawr. Oh, here's a great spot for it. Hmm, I'll save my bow tie for later. Now I'm ready to do some frosting. Oh, look at that, it's so pretty. Wow, three little ringlets. Let's do a little fourth one. Wow. Okay, let's put on some embellishments. Bananas. Open this up. 
Whoa, check it out. Sprinkle these on top. Okay, let me put on the bow. <laughs> Check it out. We did it. We did it. We never ever quit it. We did it. <laughs> yeah. Wow, awesome. We decorated a cake. <gasps> Whoa. Decorating cakes is fun and creative too. First, we got inspiration. Then, we cut shapes into the fondant. And then we frosted our friendship cake. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. Okay, friend. I'll see you later.